We're talking with Annalise Savageo as the Osakas girls have beaten Upslet tonight here at the Osakas gym, the final 72 to 62. You know, uh, Annalise, uh, one of the things I felt in the game, guarding Amy Pelzer. What's the game plan? How did you work on her tonight? I had to play man-to-man -man and tried to limit her touches, and my team was helping inside when she would post me up, and we would try to double-team her. When you think back to the first time when uh, Uppsala beat you guys, what was the difference in this game? Now, last game it was only, you know, 45 points, this time 72. What's, what's the difference? We shot way better. I think last time we shot, like, 24 or 25 percent from the field, and this time I'm sure it was a lot higher than that, so that helped a lot. You know, look at this scoring. Maddie Fursell, one basket in the first half. She had 18 points, 16 points in the second half. What was she doing out there to get herself open? Um, well, I'm not sure, but she got open somehow, and she made the shots when she took them. Mm -hmm. All right. Talk about your team and uh, what you guys have to do to have success out there. What are some of the things that uh, Coach Calpine talks about? How do you guys, uh, how do you have a record here of 17-2 uh, and two so far? Our defense helps a lot because we don't usually let up a ton of points a game. Tonight we let up more than usual, but we create a lot of steals and our press helps too. You know, this is a team too that uh, I recognize a lot of names from volleyball, right? Mm -hmm. Yep. How does that help you, do you think, by being a, a multi-sport multi athlete out there? What are, what are some of the things that you could talk about with that? Keeps me in shape a lot more, and I think it b help builds leadership. And you, a lot of these people are on both teams, volleyball and basketball, so we get to know each other a lot well, a lot better. Yeah. And you know these girls pretty well too that you're playing against, right? Yeah. So you know what you have to do. Again, what does coach uh, talk about that you have to do against this team to beat them? Um, we have to shut Amy Pelzer down a lot, and just take care of the basketball and make shots when we are open. You know, I realize it's still a few weeks away, but you've got the playoffs coming up. You know, Sox Center just down the road, and, and you beat Sox Center that night. Can you talk about that game and how you guys did that? Um, uh, I think we played really good defense that game, and it's hard to remember, but I know I think Maddie had a really good game that time, too, and she hit a lot of shots. Well, yeah, you shot very well. The game sure changes when the ball goes in the basket, doesn't it? Yeah. All right. So are you looking forward to uh, the rest of the games here to get ready then for the playoffs? Can you beat Sox Center again? Yeah, I think we could, but it would be close again like it was. Mm -hmm. All right. Good win tonight. Congratulations. Thank you. All right. That's Annalise Savageau.